like how to balance the creative life with the military <laughs> life, right? And because a yeah. lot of people don't uh, like, you know, they keep those worlds separate a lot of times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you have an um, interesting viewpoint. In all honesty, man, like I don't, I don't think I ever did master that line. Mm. Um, because like, I, I remember, you know, like in, in acting school or whatever I got, I went to the American Academy of Dramatic Arts. Um, and I remember like, yeah. it was always encouraging, you know, make mistakes, explore your emotions. How do you feel? And I'm like, uh, no, you don't make mistakes. People die if you do that. Um, how I feel doesn't matter. I got a job to do. Get it done. So, yeah, like, legit, it's a, it was a double life, and it was the weirdest thing and, like, the hardest thing I'd ever done. Um, sure. Because, I, like, I didn't, even growing up, like, I didn't have sort of that artsy. I've been doing this since, you know, I was a kid background. Like, that just wasn't my story. Right. Um, sure. And so being there, like, it was it was crazy. And then and all of a sudden, of course, like, every month I go down to base where, like, in yeah. all honesty, it was so much easier doing the military thing, just being a robot and just getting the job done. It was so much easier than actually being, I guess, human, hmm. if you will. Hmm. Um, yeah, it's crazy. It was weird. You know, that actually kind of gets on an interesting point for me where mm -hmm. it's like, because um, in my opinion, like, as from an artist's perspective, mm -hmm. um, it's always, and as a theater artist specifically, it's like a lot of it's based on, you know, community. It's a communal art form, all those things. But mm -hmm. on the, that's actually with the military too. Like your yep. unit, you actually, it's highly... Um, you know, like the bonds that you create with your yeah. different units, battalions, like the, even your branches yeah, yeah, is yeah, yeah. like Definitely. a big old thing. So it's it what's the difference, would you say, like between those two worlds? I would say I think the, the biggest difference between those two worlds, um, in my opinion, is definitely I think camaraderie is more. I don't want to use the word forced, mm -hmm. um, but it's much easier in the military because I, because I, it's not this, it, granted that there is a bit of competitiveness in, in like when you want promotions and whether or not, you know, how many slots they got available, mm -hmm. but, but it's not sure. this sort of dog eat dog thing where I have to make sure you don't get the role in hopes that I get the role that there is in, in, in sort of the yeah. art and entertainment realm. Like, it's just like, yeah, like we all in this together. We're all like, there's this uh, phrase called embrace the suck. So like, cool. We all in this together. It's right. hot as hell. I don't feel like picking up a thousand <laughs> rounds that we just fired, but we in this together as opposed to, yeah. you know, what, right. what I've seen in the art realm. Totally. Yeah. Dude, yeah. We yeah. can go so into weird. that shit, too. That shit. <laughs> fuck. I had to leave that shit for a while, you know? Yeah, and it's, yeah, it's, yeah. Well, it's a real thing. And, like, and you know, to be fair, we've also, I mean, like, been luckily able to encounter deep bonds within the artistic community as well. That's also mm -hmm, why mm -hmm, it keeps bringing mm -hmm. me back. But, yeah. yeah, for sure, it's like with the military world, you're you're forced yeah. to cooperate. Yeah. And Absolutely. sometimes I wish that like, I, I sometimes I wish that we had to do that a little bit more mm -hmm. often in our world. You yeah, know, yeah, yeah. It's, it's so easy. Yeah. It, 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 it makes, it makes everything that much better. Like even those bad moments, those moments where you're tired, you're hungry, you've been moving in mud, like, or you just, you just want to go home. Like mm. it makes all those moments so much better. As opposed to like, you know, when you have like we all got personal issues, right? So you got personal issues going on or whatever, but it makes it easier to know that, okay, at least I got somewhat of a family here as opposed to are these people that I'm working with, all these, you know, artists that I'm meeting and uh, networking right, with, right. Um, you know, are they really here for me? Do they have their best interest, my best interest at heart? Like, am, are they going to look out for me the same yeah. way I want to look out for them? Yeah. Um, and I, I don't think you have to worry about that as much. Right, um, in the military for sure. Yeah, so yeah. so it can be a lot easier just at least having one safety blanket. Yeah. Um, like I remember when I was deployed, things got really, really bad for me. Um, but uh, a guy that I'm, that he, he became like a second dad to me. I love him to this day. Mm. Um, his name is Sergeant Pike. And uh, like he was there for me and sort of carried me through. Um, things got a little dark. Yeah. I almost became a number as far as uh, almost, you know, uh, Right. Took, took myself off but um but yeah. like but like i said like he was there for me so like i i had him and, and others you know and as that family as that base my yeah. personal life was not what i oh, wanted so to be good. or my time over there was not what i needed it to be right so, and that's yeah, so, that's yeah. awesome that's powerful right and you know um and that, i think that's what we what we should try to strive for within the artistic realm right and um like in that in that those kind of terms i've been in uh, I've had mentors in my life um, that, like, I remember, like, my first year of college, like, mm -hmm. I was, like, you know, I got done with doing this scene, um, 
and I just felt like shit. You know when you just like bomb a scene, <laughs> you just like go up. And I back in that day too, I was like, oh, I'm the big shit. You know what I mean? Like I was the best. I was leading my high school all the time. You know what I mean? I and, wouldn't know what that feels like. But go yeah, ahead. But, you know, right, right. But well, it was like I came in there, and then like the first scenes that we do, like I was like, yeah, I got this shit unlocked, whatever, you know. And then we do it. We do our performance, our final performance, and I was mm-hmm. like. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Damn. <laughs> I just bombed up there. And I remember like going to the my professor the next mm. day. Just, well, no, right after the class. And I was just like bawling. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. And uh, Timothy McEwen Begay, um, who is the guy that I talked to, I was like, I just don't know if I'm supposed to be doing this for my life. I don't know if I'm able to like, what did I just waste my yeah, life? Cause like I've been second guess everything. Yeah. And he actually mm-hmm. kind of attacked it in a military standpoint. Now that I look back on it. Cause he was like, I'm crying and everything. I'm letting all this out. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And he's like, can I tell you something? And I was like, yeah. And he's like, get over yourself. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that's, oh, that's okay. what I was like, I was like, I was like uh, what? <laughs> 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 like, Damn. Like, uh, uh, well, okay. Well, he was like, Sorry. get over yourself, you know? And in the sense of, like, is this what you want to do with your life? Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, yeah. And yeah. he's like, is this the thing that drives you in your artistic career? It's like, is this where you want to be? And mm-hmm. I'm like, yeah, of course. And he's like, you already made it. You're already here. Oh, that is, that's you know, good. that's good. So get out of your own way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's good. That's a, I know. Who is he? I need to meet him. Uh, he's <laughs> he's amazing. Timothy McEwen Begay. Uh, oh, Nick knows him as well. Highly recommended. Yeah. Yeah. He's a great acting, coach. great acting coach, a great director, and stuff like that too.